Hey, hello everyone, and welcome to Lazarus. My name is Rakuna. Uh, I see that I already got Eagle Knight here. Hey, Eagle! Yeah, it's time for some scary time, because uh, yesterday, uh, Frankie was kind enough to gift me this game, and I've tried it out a little bit yesterday, and I put a stop to it because I liked it. It was uh, very spooky, very scary, and uh, we're going to get into it right now. Four years ago, a ship called the MTS Endurance disappeared on its voyage across the Atlantic Ocean. It has recently re-emerged. You are a member of a rescue team sent to investigate a distress signal coming from the once lost cargo vessel. All attempts to communicate with the ship have failed. Let's do this. Hey, Wolfie! Hey, how's it going? Press space to start. So, uh, let, let's go. Now, uh, let me know if uh, the volume is too high or if I should lower the volume a little bit. Might get a little loud. Hey, Exo, how you doing? Welcome to the stream. Hope you like horror games. <laughs> So he's talking, but you can barely understand what he's saying. Might read it out for you. There's no way to put the helicopter down. Ooh, it is very loud. We need to make contact. Oh, John, I think you can rappel onto the deck. Blah, blah, blah. I went too fast. I couldn't read it. That's okay. Let's uh, rappel down bare hands. Ah. Seems like that would have hurt a lot. All right, bye bye, Chopper. See you later. Don't worry, I'm good. So we're starting off on a very creepy looking ship. It is dark. It is damp. Everything is wet. I'm only here until I get scared. No, you're gonna you're gonna push through. You're good. Everything will be okay. Alright, so we got a key over here. A ladder key. Now, you will notice that it is a little funny how this uh, game is uh, very much like Resident Evil. The crane should be able to move this. So, we got to go up to the crane right over there. Let's go take a nice leisurely walk on this ship that is uh, always tilting left and right. But, uh, yeah, visually, graphically, the game is, uh, is beautiful. It is very well done. Now my cat is blocking the chat. Thank you, cat. Can you please move your butt? Just a second. Hey, get your ass out of the way, okay? I can't see people riding. Thank you. But I think once we get inside, it's going to be a little... Uh, you won't hear as much noise. It's going to be a little quieter. So let's uh let's play with that. And it freaking yanked it out of the way. So we can now proceed inside. And I I it's uh, just sad that we can't slide down the ladder like pros. That would be awesome. Now, I wonder, can we climb on the other side? There seems to be another crane as well. Hey, Spirit! Hello, what is this? I've never heard of it. It's a uh, Lazarus. It just came out not too long ago. I think it released 1.0 on the uh, 20th of February. So it's still quite fresh and uh, still quite spooky. All right, let's get out of this damp weather. This is... Uh, not awesome temperatures there to be hanging out outside. Let's go through there. And we got the entrance over here. Let's do this. Okay. Ooh, it's gotten a little quieter now. <laughs> hey, how's it going, Chart? Welcome to the stream. Okay, so things have gotten a lot quieter. It's very dark and creepy down here. Now we got a hallway going over there. And this seems to be going nowhere. 
can't interact with the door. What is... Seeing some things with a shadow. Oh, it's bugs. Oh, find anything? Not yet, but it looks like we were... Yeah, like we were right about the lo lockdown. Make your way up to the superstructure. You should be able to release a lockdown from the bridge. And maybe someone up there can tell us what's going on. Will do. Right, let's go in this room first of all. Ah, search efforts are underway to locate the research ship that has gone missing in the Atlantic. The ship... Was, uh, which was designed to dredge up important archaeological relics from the seabed, has gone missing along with its entire crew, including renowned archaeolo archaeologist Dr. Alfred Hay. Hayes. Hayes, yeah. Uh, Dr. Hayes, the lead researcher from the expedition, had reported finding the most unusual artifact before the ship's disappearance. No further details of the artifact were transmitted, leaving researchers to speculate on what this new discovery could have been. This article seems to be most recent in the stack of newspapers clipping of similar disappearances going back decades. Well, that's it. Uh, we need a code. And that is pretty much all there is in this room. I'm already scared. There's nothing to be scared of. Everything's a-okay. Ooh, what is that? Alright, push push the box. I can't push the box. Hey, thank you very much, Natch, for the subscription. That is awesome. Yay, one per person on my YouTube live channel. Where's Seth and his screen? Well, I mean, I'm usually, I usually don't stream on Mondays, so maybe he didn't see the announcements. All right, so we got a locked door over there. Let us go downstairs deeper in the belly of the ship. I mean, what could go wrong, right? Everything's gonna be fine. Yeah, I'm not nervous. Are you nervous? I'm not nervous. Uh, hi, hey, okay, whatever it is, it's not moving, so, should be fine then. <coughs> oh, all right, so we seem to have a couple of dead bodies over here. Hi, hey, uh, you okay, dude? You need a hand? Do you need medical assistance? He's not answering. Can't be broken by hand. So you can crouch over here. Hmm. Makes me want to go inside there. <laughs> I'm sure I'm sure everything's okay. Ah, uh, Henry and the doctor left to destroy uh, the communications equipment two days ago. They still have back. At this point, we can only assume that they're dead. Wow, that is a major assumption. So, yeah, this is how we can save our game through the uh, tape recorder. And this is where we can hide. Yeah, don't we all love games where you can hide in lockers, right? Whoa! What's that? Oh shit! Hi! Hey, what's what's up, man? I guess you tried hiding in lockers, a uh, uh, locker, and it, it didn't work out for you, man. All right? Did did I find anything in here? Anything of use? Oh wait a second. Uh, nope, nope. What the hell? Did I just hit that with my head and I panicked? <laughs> that is not good. But you know what? There's nothing... Nothing here. Alright, maybe I gotta go back. Hi, don't move, please. But over here. Not seeing anything. 
Hey, Diggs. Have a good stream, thank you. Yeah, we'll we'll do. Try not to shit my pants. All right, so I went down there. I didn't find anything. What the hell was that? All right, still nothing over here. Well, I kind of expect to find something. All the noises in here is really nerve-wracking. So far, I didn't find anything, nor did I find a combination. Okay, this is... I believe this is the exit. My god, there's so many freaking noises in this goddamn ship. Yeah, make your way to the superstructure. That is the objective. Aside from that, I'm not getting anything else. I probably missed something downstairs. Let's go see if we can make our way back. There's got to be an item that will allow us to continue to proceed. Yeah, that is still locked. I don't know why the hell it would have changed. So we had to go down here. And we just got to figure out what it is that we had to do down here. Well, there's obviously something on the other side. We just can't get to it. Can you please stop hitting that goddamn light with your head? <laughs> Jesus. All right. There's nothing on that. And do you have anything, sir? Yeah? Well, this is strange. So whatever I had to do here, it's... Uh, it, it's done. So I gotta go back, I presume. I did play a little bit yesterday, and uh, I remember that I found a note eventually with the code. Yeah, with a code to the room. Uh, code to the uh, briefcase that we found earlier. I'm not spotting anything. Maybe I'm not looking carefully enough. All right, we saw all of that. This is definitely helping me to sleep. That's good. The chain was moving. <laughs> I'm not. I, I didn't say I was gonna. I wasn't gonna be scared, Nat. All I know is I don't mind being scared. I love the. Uh, I love the rush. Okay, so we have nothing here. Jesus Christ, I feel like I'm turning around in circles now. Let's go see if I can go back up. Nope, it's not letting me out of here. Oh, for poop's sake, where was that note? Hmm. Maybe I can't have ran past it or something? It's definitely not in there. We already checked that way. 
I'm going back to my sushi game. Come on, it's gonna be fine. <laughs> you don't have a flashlight. I know. So, if I'm missing something, it's gonna be in here. That's for sure. We found this note. All the noises. Oh, look at that. Okay, so we got a piece of paper, 1947. That's what I missed. Alright, move aside there, uh, little creatures, guys, things. I'm going upstairs and I'm going to open up that briefcase. <clears throat> Nothing creepy about this place at all. All right, 1947. And we got an anchor, anchor relic. All right, let's head back downstairs. I know where that goes. Just gotta always look around each corner in case something decides to happen. I don't want anyone to miss any of the jump scares. Hi. Hey. <laughs> uh, there was a dude at the end of the hallway that just, uh... Was it you? Hi. You? No? Was it you? Jesus Christ, I'm hearing footsteps. All right. <laughs> Like I said, very weird Resident Evil type structure there when they, uh... I'm hearing noises again. God darn it. Yeah, when you gotta solve puzzles like that to open doors. Oh shit, something is down there. Something is down there. I think I should just move along and ignore it. got a dude over there got another note some of the crew were sad desperately trying to get the main deck today uh, despite the many uh, despite the captain's orders to not go outside they were adamant uh, that they had to get go get above deck and some even had to be physically restrained weather lock system has been overwritten to stop anyone from trying this again like it or not we're all stuck here now Oh, that is really reassuring. All right, before we go up there, I'm just going to check. Aha! I have found an ubo. Must be uh, some sort of collectibles that you can find throughout the game. Now you, I'm coming to see you. Don't you dare freaking move. Don't don't you move. Ugh. I think I know exactly where this goes. I... <laughs> I don't like how they, they tell you, Oh, press shift to run as if something's going to be chasing you. <laughs> it's not frightening at all. I'm hitting all these goddamn chains on purpose. Nope. What the frickin' hell. It looks like you we were uh, leaking fuel. We need to head back now. But we'll return as soon as possible. We'll be out of communication range until then. I'm sure my guy is completely thrilled. Of course. They had to leave me alone in this frickin' death hole. Alright, let's do a save. That, that's a thing there. When I'm playing a game like this, I like to save every frickin' half second. Okay. What the hell? Oh shit. 
<laughs> Come at me! Okay, fine. I knew it was nothing. <laughs> uh. What was that? A lot of things. A lot of things are happening. Alright. You unlocked it. <laughs> Have at thee! <laughs> All right, so stairs going up, stairs going down, and uh, obviously, with all the clutter over there, I obviously got to go down. Oh, great! We have friends. That is just freaking fine and peachy, and we got a locker here to hide. It's not a good sign. All right, so it's been half a second. Let's save again. Just don't move, guys. Just stay there. Don't you dare start moving. Don't move on me. Oh my god. Long, dark hallway. What was that? Something whistled. Okay, so we seem to have a... Another puzzle door here. And this door, we cannot interact with it. Oh, shit. Uh... <clears throat> Hello? Oh, god damn it. <laughs> Spook me. Oh, look, it's showing this guy. And a crowbar. We're playing Half-Life by the looks of it. Come on, put your back into it. Yes. Okay. I don't like this. It's all the ambiance noise that is really nerve-wracking. It's insane. Alright, you guys just stay there. Don't move. Not allowed. No peeking. I'm gonna go back up to that room. To the workshop, actually. And we're gonna be using the crowbar on the boards. So, let's go down here. It is very dark. It's dark for me as well, so... <laughs> right, this guy's still there. Did you move slightly? Okay, let's do this. Okay, what do we have here? The statue started to appear on the third day. It was just one or two at first, but more would show up every day, and by the end of the week, there were dozens of them. Multiple pages have been torn out. Some of the statues have started moving. They've killed three people already. When evacuating the quarantined areas, I whistled to the, get the crew's attention, and one of the statues will whistle back. We've only had one more fatality in the last week. Whistling has proven an effective way of avoiding danger. Though they won't respond if you're too close. Still, I think it would be best for the rest of us to find a safe place to hold up for now. Okay, there's not many of us left now. The engines have stopped. But we can get to the bridge. There's something else on this ship. And it stalks the corridors looking for survivors. The safest place for us right now is in this room. I just hope we're rescued soon. Great. Press Q to whistle. Oh, wait, wait, wait. First of all. A flashlight. Ah, nice.
I don't like that. <laughs> I really don't like that they whistled back. I'm not seeing anything over there, but I'm not going over there. I hate you. You stay there forever. Please, never move. Alright, so now that we got the flashlight, we can uh, go back to the other section. There was a lot of dark areas. Hmm. A little paranoid. I think it's normal. Okay. Ooh, there's a couple of them over there. You know what? Time for a save. Hi, guys. Uh, just stay there. You're in chains. Okay, nobody's whistling back. Holy crap, the ambiance music is insane. They really wanted us to get paranoid. That's, this is the way to go. Huh? How about it? Can't open that door. Nothing I can do here. I think we have no choice but to go in the uh, hallway here. God, I don't like this. Are you the one that whistled back? Ugh. Seem to have a door over here. It's locked from the other side. Oh, great. There's so many of you. Okay, we have a doorway here. Let's go over there. Let's see if we can find anything. Alrighty. We got another locker, except this one's locked. Oh, shit. Hi? Okay. It said that if I'm too close, uh, it's not going to whistle back. Let's just try and keep our distance. Uh, slides are missing. So we're gonna need some slides for that. Uh. Hi! Hey! <laughs> yeah, can I close the door? I could be rude like you. He killed most of us. But not just killed, some of us he marked. A pair of old coins placed on the eyes. After a time, the body the body starts to move again. I haven't seen what happens next, but I've heard it's bone. Uh, bones twisting, flesh tearing, and then silence. The body is gone after Dot. Most of it, anyways. Oh, that's that's it. Very very instructive. Oh shit. Locker! Help! Let's not make a noise. Quiet when you get out of there. Damn it. The fact no jump scares happen uh, yet makes me weary. I'm gonna... It's gonna happen soon. 
That's gonna be fine. So we went here. Uh, oh, maybe we can go to the door across now. Okay, no signs of anything. Ah, god darn it. All right, no response. Oh! They all stopped at the same time. So it's uh, showing a clock on the wall. And we got another safe over here. I guess we better go and check that clock. Seems to be in the room where I find the, uh, the crowbar. Alright. Gotta be careful. That big guy is probably walking around here somewhere. So it is 11.35. Right. Let's head back. Uh, no, it's this one. Oh yeah. Well, this isn't too hard. Puzzles are quite easy. So we got ourselves a screwdriver. Uh, okay, where's the door? There it is. All right. <laughs> um Okay. It moved on, I think. Hey, hey guys. Uh, that came from back there. <laughs> Let's go and open this. Probably needed a screwdriver just for that as well. <laughs> if it would have grabbed me from the locker. Our games that they do that, they just open the door, grab you, and you die immediately. That's always fun. <clears throat> Is it Sonic? No, I don't think it's Sonic. Um, What is that? It's... I don't know, it's kind of hard to tell. Oh, great. Another dude. I mean, so far they haven't moved a whole lot there, so I'm not too worried. Ah! The projector slides! And we got the moon sigil. You stay there while I read this. The crew and I have been able to find out a little more about our mysterious passenger. His name is Aaron Hayes, a doctor of archaeology. Turns out that uh, he has some cargo stored in the hold, but I haven't been able to find out what it is yet. The whole situation is suspicious. Totally sus, man. Totally sus. Okay, so this takes us back to the hallway. Okay, you're still... You're still there, right? Okay. <laughs> you're not... Now moving, right? Yeah? Hearing noises everywhere, all around me. Alright, let's go for another save. Hey, buddy. I see you. Don't you dare freaking move. Okay. Was there always four of you guys? Right? <laughs> I'm going to stay on this side of the projector if you don't mind. <coughs> All right. Let's, uh, let's have a go. Oh, let's turn off the lights. Okay. OK, 
Okay, it's the same three pictures over and over again. Oh, okay, I know I know which room that is. Gotta go back. Yeah, just trying to remember, were they always in that position, or did any move since, uh, since last time I passed? It's very worrisome. Yeah, I think the room is right smack over here. Yep, oh, there it is. We gotta move this thing. And what do we get? And? What is that? Okay, there's a switch. And I got the sun sigil. Booyah! Alright, so good. Well, that's pretty cool. Nobody answered back. That means I'm safe, right? Is that what it means? So, I got the moon sigil. I got the sun sigil. You guys are all still freaking creepy as hell. Alright. All good. Now we can go to the end of the hallway and put them on the door. Oh, shit! Uh, door open! Faster! Door! Open! What the freaking hell are you waiting for? Uh, you can't see me. I'm crouched. Come on, door. Open. Maybe I can squeeze in. Oh, shit. Hey, big guy. How you doing? Oh, my god. That must have hurt. Oh, shit. Time to run. Uh, flashlight. Let's get the hell away from uh, Bioshock over there. Hi, big guy. Nope. No time. Come on. Come on. Open faster. Okay. Oh, shit. Uh, apparently not fast enough. Hey. We should stop doing that. That is very uncomfortable, sir. Oh. That was rude. That was very rude of him. But apparently I'm not dead. I awaken in a dark room, surrounded by flies and bodies. These are all victims from the Lethal Company game, since they're all in orange jump shoots. Oh god, a lot of people died. Well, they were all wearing hard hats, but apparently that did nothing for them. And uh, do we have anything? Can I go on the other side of this pile of bodies? That is gross. All of these sounds. I mean, the. The game is well made to get you on your nerves there. Really feel nervous and spooked out all the time. Is there anything uh, back here? Alright, okay, so we got a couple of containers down there. Let's go see if we can find anything useful here. Ooh! Uh, who did that? Who opened the door? <laughs> ah, freaking hell, of course it's locked. Oh, that's okay. Just gonna climb up there. Blindly. No worries, right? 
what could be an event there that kill me? Maybe we could just hide here forever. Okay, we can't see anything down there. Ugh. Did I just land on my feet after all this? Wow. Okay, we got bugs. Our shadows are freaking me out. We got, we got a symbol here. We got a red squiggly. We got a green E. There's going to be an item also I can find in here. Okay. Yeah, that's coming from the vent. Oh, we got a pitchfork. Which is... <laughs> God damn it. That is Seth. Hey, Seth. No, that spirit arc life. <laughs> Try to get me. <laughs> How dare you. Alright, let's see what we can do. We had the pitchfork here. The red was a squiggly. The green was the E? Was, was that it? Green was E, red was squiggly. And I think the last one is, uh, you know, let's just flip until we're done. Right? <coughs> <laughs> I had to. Uh, he even came over from YouTube to do it. What the hell? Well, probably got a good old friend inside of the uh, inside of one of the cargo containers. These are locked. Can you please stop that racket? Okay, no whistling back. That's good. There's a there's some sort of a door here. Let's go grab that. Let's open it. In this Oh, it takes us back here. Yeah, we went up the stairs here before. Okay. Jesus Christ, could that guy be any more noisy? Hey! My God, you can't understand a freaking word they're saying. Hi, guys. Hey. So he wants a shipping manifest. And he's going to stay in there until then. I guess he doesn't feel uh, claustrophobic. I know there's a, there's a little bit of room inside of these cargo containers, but... Okay. There's a... Something here. We've been sailing through this fog for an entire day. Now, and it uh, doesn't show any signs of dissipating. It's pretty disorienting. The fog's so thick, I, you can't even tell if it's day or night. Sounds like the crew on the main deck are being affected by it pretty badly. The captain ordered that time on, on the main deck should be limited for ne to necessary work only. I hope we're out of this soon. Hi. Hey. What's up, man? Eh? Oh, shit. Okay. Is there, uh, anything around you? Right? 
Oh, I heard something. Is there anything in here? All right. I can't. <laughs> I can't. Well, there's obviously something over there. But apparently the uh, I could jump in a vent before, but now I can't. It's just like a very limited time skill that I had. I would that thing wiggle for a second. All the lin noises. Oh, a valve. Hey, could you move out of the way, sir? No. Watching you. I have both eyes on you. Let's go back through these vents. What could go wrong? Oh, shit. Was that you, buddy? Was that you? Or you? What? I thought I heard moving. I thought I heard some footsteps. Okay, there's nobody behind me still. That's a good sign. And even with a flashlight, this room seems to be, uh, it seems big. We can't get through. So we'll just leave it as is for now. Right, this seems safe. No whistling back. What do we have here? Uh, security room key. Oh shit! What the fuck? Ah! All right, probably had a very nice expression there. Ah, <laughs> oh, you piece of crap! Uh, things are looking bad. I gotta catch my breath there. <laughs> We've been sailing through the fog for two days and with no end in sight. Early this morning, the navigation equipment stopped working, and now the engines have cut out. We're working as hard as we can to repair them, but they're, we're dead in the water right now. We sent out a distress signal. I don't think I'll be getting any sleep tonight. Right, any more freaking surprise scares now? So we found a key. What is the key? Uh, security room key. Okay, where's that? It's not it, right? No, that's probably on the other side of uh, where the kind of doll thing was. Oh, <laughs> you got some, you got some uh, some bonus shizzles because you've been here three streams in a row. That's cool. <coughs> Excuse me. <clears throat> So, uh, hi. Okay, you're still not moving. Uh, there were two doors upstairs that we couldn't open before. Let's go see if this lock's, uh, gonna be for one of them. Just hang in there, guys. I'll be right back. That's not it. Ooh, found it. Oh God, what the freaking hell is that? What? That bastard moved. Uh, okay. Uh, these are are these uh, manifests? Where is it? Where'd it go?
Where'd the freaking tentacle go? God damn it. There's something weird in Cargo Hold 2. As I was inspecting the machinery, I heard a strange rhythmic humming coming from one of the containers. I tried to investigate, but the cargo inspector stopped me and said he'd look into it. I haven't heard the sound since. The cargo inspector doesn't say anything when questioned about it and pretends not to have any memory of the encounter. God damn it. <laughs> nice try. Nice try. Hey, that guy wasn't there before. That that one over there, that dude there, I remember it wasn't anyone there. Wait a second. Okay. You know what? You stay there, buddy. You stay there. I'm just gonna go, uh, scaringly go and just do a little save here, just in case, right? Is that you? Are you the piece of shit that whistled? Okay. Go r What the freaking hell? I just got the banish face this dude and now he's gone. What is this? Okay, uh fuse. Don't you dare get any closer, you bastard. It feels like I've been down here forever. Taking the fuse from the freight elevator has stopped anything from getting down here. But rations are running low. I'll need to get out of here soon. The passage between the cargo hold 1 and 2 is flooded. I'll need to drain it before I can reach the elevator up to the superstructure. But the pump is broken. There should be a replacement part of on one of the service decks. <clears throat> what are my chances of making it alone? Maybe I'll wait here just a bit longer. You couldn't have just waited for me to come back, you dick. Ah, you little freaking dick. Why do you keep smashing my head and just running away? Like an asshole. What are you looking at? Dicks. I hate you all, by the way. Just, just you know, make it clear. I hate the lot of you. You too. <clears throat> I have no preference for any one of you. Okay, is this, uh... This is nothing. This is absolutely nothing. Nada. Niente. Oh, look at that. Uh, there's a part missing from the water pump. Okay, so this is going to be where I'm going to try and, uh pump the water in between cargo bay one and two. Makes sense. There's nothing else in there. Okay, so now we gotta find where the elevator is. I mean, they've been pretty good so far as to indicating where everything is with uh, mark, uh, you know, markings on the ground, on the floor. I don't know if you can get killed in this game. The only thing they do is bonk you on the head and run away. Wait, 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 wait. You weren't there. You weren't there. You're the one that moved and came back over here after you bonked me in the head, you maniac. I got a crowbar. Oh, the freaking asshole moved. I'm looking at you. Uh-huh. Oh shit, there's the elevator. Let me, let me save. Yep. Stay put. Later, suckers! <laughs> Alright. 
We're making progress. I even got an achievement. Going up! Yay! Uh. This is a big freaking ship. <laughs> it's a big ship. Find a replacement part for the water pump. Basically, I just need a pipe, right? There is a pipe. Just take it out. Ooh, what is this? Oh, okay, it's a save. Ah, uh, <laughs> uh, you're not gonna scare me that easy. Okay, so let's go ahead and move along these uh, these hallways. This takes me to cargo hold. It's not exactly where we want to go. My God, these passageways are really narrow. Oh, I can open the door here. Oh, hi. Been trying to get the engines back up and running for days now, with no success. Some of the crew are starting to become despondent. Unfortunately, many of them have also taken up uh, Dr. Hayes' infuriating hobby of building random contraption. <laughs> yeah, the making all... The uh, frickin' screw you, buddy. Oh, God damn it. Can I move? Can I? Can you, can you please get out of the freaking way? Oh, Jesus Christ. I can't even. Oh, there you go. I can close the door. I don't like you. A piece is missing. Oh, God. Something's going to happen. Safety storage room key. Why the ominous music? Why? So there's a puzzle to do here. Guess I could leave the door open, right? What could happen? He obviously whistled back. He's not following. I'm good. I'm just peachy. Hell. Oh, Freaking hell. Really? Uh. <sighs> no guts, no glory. No so. Oh my god, I hate this. Where did that come from? Came from that way. I'm gonna go this way then. I gotta go the way of the whistling. Ah, freaking hell, dead end. I hate you all. <laughs> okay. I, I didn't see anybody over there. Nope, I'm not going that way, following the guy there. I'm just going to go to Cargo Hold. And, uh... uh the door needs power. Alright, we don't have power. That is our main objective. Let's go back to the other way, where we obviously see, uh, saw somebody. Ah. Uh. Hi. Did I come from outside? Ah! I had the key for this! Not exactly sure. Oh! Okay, that is for the uh, other puzzle that we saw earlier. And uh, what do we have in here? Do we actually have anything in there? Okay, no. Receive a radio signal from a uh, rescue team today. We tried to respond and let them know our situation, but we're unable to transmit. There was no sign of the helicopter through the fog. After a while, we heard the rescue team say they couldn't see any sign of the ship and would begin searching a different area. Strangely, 
They said they had a clear view of all the way to the horizon. The radio's been quiet ever since. I feel sick. Our only hope now is to get the engines working. That is ominous. It's like a whole Silent Hill kind of vibe there. <clears throat> the most intense item grab ever. I <laughs> know, right? Okay, so you can open all these lockers and there's nothing special. Just lots of shoes and security vests. And one of them's got to hold something nice, right? If they allowed you to open them, this guy's there's some shit in there. Somewhere. Or is it like a combination of open and close that you got to do, which is a which will open a secret magical door to Narnia? Yeah. yeah. Okay. Where'd that asshole go? Yeah, for crying out loud. I didn't go there, but... Oh, shit. Okay, so it was on the left. And back over there. <laughs> um... Yeah, it was somewhere around here that we had one of the doors uh, that was uh, that I had the puzzle in. I think it's maybe at the end of this hallway. Yes. Hey, you're still freaking there, aren't you? God damn it. Don't touch me. Okay, so we got to play a rotating game. Oh, God. Okay. That's going to be fun. Okay, so we basically... Yeah, you know, I feel like I just got to do something like this. or They wouldn't make it that obvious uh, that we could make a direct connection or anything. They want to make a, take advantage of the uh, whole freaking maze there. There you go. Got it. Booyah! Yeah? High five? No? Well, screw you. Stay there forever for all I care. Oh, fuck. Um. Uh, hey! Uh. <laughs> I don't, I don't, I don't want this to happen. Please! No! Come on! I don't want to drown. I haven't saved in a little while there. What? Oh, screw you. That was just a an illusion. <laughs> ah, bastards. All right, where was the save point before? I just want to head back this was the elevator this is the save point i'm gonna save <laughs> all right okay and we never checked this side but i don't think there's anything we can do around here <clears throat> all right let's go let's do this I don't think that the whole whistling does all that much. I really don't. I think this was it. Uh, where was... Where's the door again that we needed the power for? Ah, for crying out loud. It's probably across all this, uh, this hallway of arms and all that.
I don't think it was here. Maybe this is it. Yeah. Hells yes. All right. Doesn't feel safe. Not at all. I don't like that. <laughs> ah, this looks like a freaking Star Wars moment where every, the walls are going to come down on me or something like that. Can I go over that way? Ah, oh, shit. Hi, Seth. Only Seth gets me. God damn it. <laughs> you got me good, buddy. Got me good. <laughs> uh, oh, shit. Watch where you're going. Oh, that goddamn flashlight. All right, guys. This is going to be a dark stream from now on until we get the flashlight back. You better not whistle back. You better not frickin' whistle back, you asshole. Oh, shit. Alright. I'm gonna close the door behind me because somehow I feel like it's gonna be a little safer. Are these pumps as well? Oh, there you go. This part is bolted on. Oh, shit. I was woken up, uh, yeah, I was woken up early this morning by a loud scraping sound against the side of the ship. I thought we might have hit something in the fog, but when I ran to the main deck, there was nothing. There has been other sounds heard intermittently, me, me speaky good, throughout the day, banging on the hull, the sound of scrapping metal, a low rumble from beneath the ship. Each sound was investigated, but we found nothing. Well, maybe you're looking good enough. So I believe we need to find a wrench or something. Okay, that's locked from the other side. Hey, dark hallway. <laughs> Missed you terribly. Shit. Oh, you bastard. You're walking. Bastard was oh my god, there's another one over here. I hate you all. Don't you Down oh, dunk you bastard! Stop doing that! He does it and just runs away. Asshole! I don't think he had you killed. Oh there he is. I think it's him again. Okay, this is rusted shut. Maybe a little bit of a WD-40, right? Something of the sort. All right, I don't think he's going to be able to follow me through here. <laughs> yeah, Seth is the master at that. He's the, he's the, he's the master at scaring me with that freaking sound thing. Okay, so what do we have here? A save. Noise. And we got ourselves a note. My father has been missing for over a year now. But today I received a mysterious package from someone who claims to have known him. Inside the package was a strange artifact like nothing I've ever seen before. Apparently during one of his expedition, my father had found three such relics. Two of them was uh, he was carrying with him when he disappeared and this one he sent to me. Holding the relic in my hand, I know that it had something to do with his disappearance. Perhaps, perhaps I can use it to find him. Perhaps indeed. Have you tried? That's locked. Obviously, it's locked. All right, guys. Uh, I'm going to take a little uh, bio break. Uh, two minutes. I will be right back.
Okay, I'm back. I just turned off the lights behind me because I really want to get spooked and have a heart attack. Apparently, I like it. Oh, what do we have here? Oh, and by the way, my uh, mute button's working. Oh, what the hell? Uh, can I not interact with this at all? Apparently not. I think I need some uh, cogs for this. Oh, okay. Oh, God damn it. Don't whistle. Don't whistle. Okay, there's whistling outside. It's fine. You're not gonna... You're not gonna do anything, right? The wrench! Noise! You moved. Did you move? Why is there, like... Why is there a ladder here? What's the point of this? Keeping my eyes on you, buddy. I don't like you. Pretty sure he moved. Not exactly sure, 100%, but I'm pretty sure he did. Right, let's go back. Um. Yeah, that was locked. I gotta go back. I gotta go back and get that uh, part for the pipe. Why do I get my flashlight back? I, I would love to have it back, if you don't mind. This is uh, spooky enough as it is. Can I just bash this with the pimp wrench? Pipe wrench? Pimp wrench. My god, I'm mixing my words tonight. <laughs> hey, Stubert! <laughs> Welcome! How you doing, buddy? Yeah, playing some freaking horror game tonight. Off schedule stream. Hi. Don't, don't move. Just stay there. Ah, oh, this is it. Oh, God. Maybe. Oh, somebody whistled back. <clears throat> yes! Goodness. Anybody in here? I have a cog. You stay there. I said stay there. Stop moving, dick. You don't move. Stay there. Is it me or are we missing somebody here? There was a, a, a another one. I don't see where he is. You know, let's just run. Let's go. Is that a big cog? It is a big cog. I will be using this cog on this device. Okay, um, move, I, sp I suppose. No, 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 uh, move that over here. What? Oh, I have seven moves. Oh, shit. Okay, I can switch him wherever the freaking hell I want. Okay, okay, okay. I thought I thought they had to be moving, like, one next to each other. So that shouldn't be too much of a problem. Okay, uh, I think I should be able to get it next time. <clears throat> that 
this just below. Okay, yeah, I knew shit. Yeah, I gotta do this again. Okay. <clears throat> Booyah! Got it working. Not too hard. Jesus Christ, could it be any noisier? Jeez, okay. Oh. An awesome key. Oh, shit! Uh. Don't. You just toss me on the floor. What a dick. And he's gone. Of course, he's freaking. Hi. Hey, stay there. Whatever you do, just frickin' stay there. Oh, save. Alright, paint room. There's a lot of paint in here. Alright, can we find uh, some s hidden stuff over here? Yeah. Oh, rust remover. Oh, nice. Right. I don't think we have anything in here. There's nothing over there. So we can open the uh, trap door. That is uh, currently rusted shut. Let's go over there and do that. <laughs> as long as there's no cog picks. Yes, remove the rust. <laughs> of course, that looks extremely safe down there. I want to go down there. Hey, I do want to go down there. That's where my flashlight is. I got to find a goddamn thing. Not exactly sure where it fell, but hopefully we'll be able to find it. And uh... Okay, that's just a light. Not spooky at all. go up here to begin with. Okay, we got stairs going up. Don't whistle back. Asshole. Asshole. <clears throat> Sorry. <laughs> Voices giving out. Uh, some of the crew have begun to experience this chest pain as they've uh, and have been uh, sent to the sick bay. We're not quite sure what's causing it, but uh, we have an in, uh, extensive medical facility on board, and so we should be able to treat them. I'd still feel better if we could get to uh, them to a proper hospital. Yeah, I'm not. I'm not going to approach you, okay? If you don't mind. Uh, maybe I want to go over this side. Jesus Christ! Oh, that asshole moved. That asshole moved. Okay, there's nothing over here. Look how he's holding his chest like he's been having chest pains as well. Kind of contributing to the story here. Uh-huh. Okay, we can't go there. Sir, have you seen my flashlight? Oh, that asshole moved. Yeah, you're going to whistle back. Absolutely. Of course you're going to whistle back. Leave me alone. Don't follow me. I knew it. You stay there. And I'm just going to go check over here real quick. Yep, it's nothing. I'm gonna go down there. I got my eye on you, buddy. Don't you dare move a muscle. Uh. Oh, shit! Ow! <laughs> my guy's living a freaking nightmare. Bad experience. 
So on the other side is probably where I dropped my flashlight, or was it on top here that I was walking before? So if I'm not mistaken, my flashlight should not be too far from here. Found a cargo ship that should be uh, taking a similar route uh, that my father took on this uh, final voyage. I was able to pay off the captain to take me on board, no questions asked. We're leaving tomorrow morning. I'm too anxious to sleep. But with the artifact securely stowed, there's nothing to do but wait and see what happens. So, this artifact, if I'm not mistaken, is freaking cursed. Yep, it is cursed. Oh god, it's dark. Of course. You know what? Nope. Nope, 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 nope. I don't know where I am. I feel like I've been here before. I feel like it. Hey, come back here. Do you know where my flashlight is? I can open the goddamn oh, freaking hell. Ah. Uh. Of course, I'd want to go through the door where that guy was moving and looking at me. Jesus. Oh, for poop's sake. Where's my goddamn flashlight? All the way back to cargo hold one. All right, okay. So, yeah, this is the way back to cargo hold one. The only thing is I'm pretty sure I want my flashlight back. What do I do? Should I try and go find the uh, flashlight or should I just go back to cargo hold one and maybe uh, I'll come across another flashlight? What do you guys think? <laughs> I want to see what you guys think before I uh, continue. I'm not even sure if I can get a hold of uh, my, my flashlight that dropped in a hole. There are a couple of places I don't think that I've checked yet. So that is the question. Don't you all answer at the same time. <laughs> <coughs> Grab the light that was on the ground. What light? Ah, uh, yeah, no, apparently you can't grab those. You can't grab the little lights on the ground. Ugh. Well, you know what? I'm still not sure of what I want to do. I feel like it's obvious we dropped it. That means we should be able to retrieve it. But again, we could always go back and... Uh, just go up to the elevator. I hate this. You know what? I'm just going to go do a quick run, see if I can spot the god darn thing. I wasn't away. That was not the way. That was the door with the generator. My flashlight fell down there somewhere. Ah, shit, I can't go back. Yeah, it took me up here, and that was it. That's it. I can't go back. So, yeah, there's only one way to go now. Suppose I'm going to find myself another light eventually. Wrong way. Go back this way. Wrong way again. A 
Okay. I completely went the wrong way. <laughs> I'll find. I'll find the right way. I was at the freaking elevator. Now I'm getting lost in this god darn maze. Wait a second. This is still the freaking generator. Ah. Not it. This is the way. This is the way. This is the way. <laughs> this is the way. Going around in freaking circles here. Yeah, I feel like this is the way. Am I the only one hearing weird noises? Okay. Yes, we're back at the elevator. Okay, and hopefully we'll find ourselves another source of light later. Yes! <laughs> oh, frickin' peachy, of course. Well, Turn the power to the elevator. Please note that the flare are here for emergency only and should only be used uh, should not be used indoors. Uh, in uh, igniting flares inside the ship could cause suffocation or start a fire. Well, that is just freaking peachy. A damn generator went off again this morning. Last time it happened, we were stuck down here for hours waiting for the replacement parts to be brought up from storage. Additional spares have been left in the storage room up here now in case it happens again. Well. Alright. Okay, we're not getting any answers. That's good. And is this the... is this a generator? No, no, don't do that. God damn it, I didn't want to do that. We need to find a replacement part. Okay. Uh... Oh my god, I keep pressing the wrong button. <laughs> god damn it. Uh, I managed to skate down the service deck with a few others. Uh, who are not infected. We've disabled the fray elevator so we won't be followed. It's not much, but it's enough to let us catch our breath at least. We're able to scrounge together a good pile of canned food from the gallery before we left, but we have no idea how long we're going to be stuck down here. Hopefully, we'll be able to make it out. Alright, let's not press F unless we really need to. Hit. Sure, I want to go in. It's chain shot. Okay. Oh, hi. Yeah, I can, I can barely see you, but I know you're there. Let's throw a couple of flares. Okay, if the sickness is airborne, we should probably turn off the large fan in the ventilation room to stop it circulating throughout the ship. We tried to get into the control room, but the door is locked. Gresham was holding on to the key, but he went to investigate the boiler room. And has yet to return. Well, let me guess, I'm going to have to go to the boiler room. That's a big fan. Can I walk through it? <laughs> Uh, 
Okay, I'm hearing noises on the lake. Okay, I'm not I'm not seeing any prompts or icons or anything, so I don't think there's anything. Let's see if we can get in there. Ah, it's locked. Of course it's locked. Everything is goddamn locked in here. I mean, I got a crowbar. Can I force these doors open or something? At least some of them. Alright, got another door over here. Oh, great, of course. Just push the goddamn door. Okay, we got a... Yeah, we need a password here. Got another door. It's locked from the other side. Uh... Fine. Is it me or did we not? Is there not like another passageway somewhere? Okay, there's nothing in here. Let's go see. There must be something else, something that we've missed. Oh, of course. Let's go through the dark little tunnel there. You know what? I'm, I, I think I could grab more flares. Yeah, picked up six flares. Oh yeah, of course this is going to get dark real soon. No fucking hell, what a... Okay. Must have hit a big wave or something. And what is this? There's something in the boiler room. Luke cornered me today, adamant, and that he saw something in there. At first I thought that one of the statues might have made it up here somehow. But as I approached the open door, I could hear whatever it is against the far wall, just beyond the light's reach. I got out of here as quickly as I could and locked the door behind me. We should stay out of that room unless we have no other choice, but in case of emergency, the combination is uh, 3792. 3792. Right. Well, apparently we're going in there. We got flares. So whatever's in there won't be able to hide. Uh-uh. I got light swords. And yeah, we can't use this door. Okay. I don't think we're alone down here. I can hear skittering in the walls. I tried to tell myself it was all in my head, but now Gresham has gone missing. For safety, I think we need to, to hold up one of the rooms. Uh, a box of flares is all we have to keep whatever's down here at bay. It's great. Okay, drain water from the lower floors. That's uh, going to be part of uh, you know, using the pump. That's how we we're supposed to get from cargo bay A to B. 3792. Thank you, Subert, for writing it down in case my memory fails. <clears throat> That's a fan being noisy. I think it was this door, right? Yeah. Three. Seven. Nine. Two. Right, that must be a uh, must be my my dude that I was looking for. Ah, of course you did. Of course. Ah, let's go through. 
Oh god. Hey, we have flares. Let's chug one in there. It's not gonna suffocate me. Maybe it's gonna suffocate that freaking thing. I can always get more. Oh my god, that's what's left of him? Okay, ventilation control room key. Nice! Oh, this place is nicely lit up. That thing is not gonna go bug me anymore. Right? There's light here, bitch. You can't follow me. I don't like it when you're going through that so slowly. Alright, let's go to the ventilation room. At least this thing burned for a long time. I think they might just stay there and burn forever. Yes, of course I unlocked it. Uh, that should stop that. I can hear the goddamn thing skittering around. I don't like it. Oh my god, freaky noises. I'm being paranoid, I'm using too many flares, I know it. I don't give a shit. Okay. Got another note here. I don't think I'm making it out of here, out of this alive. I'm the only one left. The skittering is louder now. All I can do now is sit here and watch as the last flare burns out. Ah, poor dude. My flares are gonna last forever. Okay, so these are the flooded areas. Water pump control. And now I can explore the lower floors. Hey, what? A, getting a call? Am I getting a call? What's that noise? Was it just the console making noise? I think it was. All right. Oh, God damn it! Look at that freaking shadow that just passed. I don't like this. <laughs> I really don't. Okay. This door was locked. Uh, yeah, I couldn't open that door. There's the other door over here that I still couldn't open. That is still the generator. We still need a replacement part for that. I know, I'm being freaking paranoid again, but I'm filling up on flares. I'm gonna, I want to have all the flares in the world. I want to be Flare Man. Oh, yeah. So that is still chained shut. So, by the looks of it, they want me to go inside the room where there was a bathroom. I hate it. It's dark over there. Okay, thank you. I feel so much better. Okay, that wasn't it. Uh, where, where was that again? Did I have to go through the crawly hole over here? I think I did. Yeah. Over here. That wasn't it. That wasn't it either. Probably on the... Yeah, it was on this side. Now I remember. Oh, you... No. No. Don't. Don't. Screw this. There, there's a freaking light source. Where did it go? Where did my flare go? Oh, shit. I, I have a mallet over here. I can freaking beat you with it. Steer clear. 
Alright, it went that way, so... For some reason, I'm gonna go that way. That's not lighting up this room at all. Really? You had to go behind that goddamn pipe, didn't you? I can't see anything down here. It's okay. Is that blood? Or maybe it's just red because of the flare. God damn it, they're making me use all my flares down here. Okay, that door is locked. And this is uh, access to the storage room by the looks of it. It's seized up. Okay, well, I thought I had like... Apparently, once I use my tools, they're automatically dumped. Like a crowbar, I use it once and it's gone. The wrench, the pipe wrench, completely disintegrated as I used it. I mean, these are useful tools. You just keep them around with you, buddy. No, no, no need to get rid of them. Uh, yeah, I thought I was. I could have lit them up. Okay, it's locked from the other side, and we got a ladder going up over here. But before I do that, I... I don't want to go down there. i rather not go down there. <clears throat> I remember when I was a kid, okay? I... Would have been easier if you had a torch, right? Totally. Oh! Okay, so this is a shortcut back upstairs. That's great. I remember uh, when I was a kid, I was young, okay, like in my teens. First time I played Resident Evil, there is that, that one part where you had to enter water. And before that, you were listening or, you know, reading text about how there's a, a ginormous shark in the water. Oh god, this is going to take me underwater, isn't it? And I was too scared shitless. I was trying to find any way in Resident Evil to do something else other than to just go into deep water where the sh I know the shark would be. Because I was too scared shitless of that game. And uh, yeah, that was Resident Evil 1 from uh, on PlayStation with the uh, long-ass door-opening and loading screens. All right, we got ourselves... No, I didn't... Oh, shit, I didn't want to press F again. How many torches am I going to throw before I start to suffocate? I wonder... Aha! Grab more flares. Now, maybe that is the key that I needed to go to the uh, other room at the end of the hallway here. There were some locked doors at the end. I mean, wouldn't it be safer if I just held a, you know, a flare in my hand? No. Nope. Definitely throwing a flare in here. Okay, what is what is that down here? Bolt cutter sells yes. Okay. Guess we have to go back now. I got the bolt cutters. When's the last time I saved? I think last time I saved was a very long, unhealthy amount of time. So I better go ahead and do that as soon as I can. Uh, 
I can easily do that by going back over here. Uh, wait a second. No, that's not where the save was. Oh, shit. I don't remember where you could save. Anywho. It's bolt cutter time. Don't whistle back. Don't whistle back. Don't whistle back. Okay. He didn't whistle back. Okay, the part I need is on the other side. I got my eye on you. Oil? Wait a second. Did I need oil? I don't think that was what I needed, right? I need to find a replacement part. Where did the oil need to go? I really don't know. Uh, yeah, um... I wish I remembered where I saved last time. Oil for the storage room. Alright, and uh... Storage room. Wasn't that this room? No, that's not the storage room. I suppose it's going to be back down here. Rusted turn thing. Oh, okay, yes. Uh, the thing that was seized. That's right. That's right. Now, where the freaking hell was that? Okay, that's when you go down, uh, the jump down from the bathroom. I really don't like that that area is not lit up there. I feel a lot better now. Let the light cast away the darkness. Wasn't this the storage room? Uh, that's the workshop. Okay. Wait a second. This is... I'm going back this way. This is it. Yes! I've hold it up. We're all good. <laughs> a turn thing. It's called a valve. <laughs> I might chug another one at the other end there. There you go. I want to make sure that it's a lot of light. So much light that it blinds me. Okay. <laughs> Bastard. Alright, so we got the generator part. And I heard it just... I <laughs> just heard a big bang. It's very comforting. Big bang. Really gotta save. Was there a save thing here? No. <laughs> what he said. Where's the save thing? Wasn't any save thing here. I can't recall where the last place could have been hidden in that corner. I I swear. Yeah, I really can't recall where the last uh, safe place was. But I've been going for a little while without saving, and I hate it. Probably my save is behind that door. That over here. 
Anyways, I think that what we can do is we can go up that generator. Uh, yeah, go to the generator, fix it, go up the elevator again, and I think then I'll be able to save, so. I hate the skittery. Ugh. Shit. Yes! Escape the service deck. Hey, wait a second. There it is. <laughs> oh, shit! No, 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 no! <laughs> I think that guy's just not going to knock me out. <laughs> I think he uh, just killed me instantly. But good thing I saved just before that. My god. Yep, 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 run, jump! Yes, you ain't gonna be able to get me, you bastard. Ha! Ah, yes. <laughs> now we can fix the water pump as soon as I frickin' remember where it was. Okay. I missed you guys. I missed you terribly. Well. Uh, of course you had to answer back. I don't have a flashlight. I know I don't have a goddamn flashlight. No, this goes back. Yeah, it goes back. I, it's not where I need to go. Okay, this won't open while the it's, uh, the other side is flooded. I just got to Okay. I think that one is moving. Maybe it is. I can't be sure. Hi. If while I'm moving, they just start walking towards me. That's not a cool sound. Nope. <laughs> no, 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 no. Not with the skittering asshole out there. Right, where are the pumps again? Aha! Yes! Okay. I think it's all good. We can go back. We could probably open up that door now. Where's that guy? There was a guy over there. Oh, he probably moved. I'm going to try and jump scare me. You weren't there. Yeah, that one moved. You know what? Screw you guys. I'm out of here. Okay, find the elevator up to the superstructure. Can I please have my flashlight back? <laughs> I wonder if you can get your flashlight back and I just totally missed the opportunity. I know I don't have a flashlight. I wish I had one. All right. Stop looking at me weird. I think it turned around. I'm sure it turned around. Uh, no, I just want to open that freaking thing. Okay. So obviously, with the last uh, the last little part that we did, 
we couldn't have a flashlight for that part. You really had to have those flares. So there was no way of getting the flashlight back. It just makes sense. Right? Yeah. Right. Right. Yeah, it does make sense. Self-evident. Yeah. Okay, there's a way to go down here. We don't want to go down. We want to go up to the uh, superstructure. Hello. Uh, hi. Hey. Okay, what do we have here? One of the valve handles is missing. Obviously. And because we don't have that little valve handle, we can't do diddly squat. So we're going to go through a complex series of, uh, of things. Just so we can get it. Oh, shit! You dick! Why would you do that? Well, he was, uh, he was human. The drive chain is missing. Fix the elevator. Right. Okay, yeah, of course. I can't see shit. And apparently my flares disappeared. Can I, uh, okay, I can go back up there. X7. Okay. All good. It's all good. Nothing personal, dude. It's too dark. Yeah, I can't go in. Okay, I don't want to go. I don't want to go back that way. There's got to be something here. There's obviously something here. Uh, you, there's this guy over there. Hi, hey. You got a you got a flashlight, buddy? I can borrow. I mean, I would love it if you could give me a flashlight. I want to see shit. So okay, there was no cog. There's nothing over here. So obviously, I think I gotta go back. I can't go in this room. I really need a flashlight. No, don't don't go down. I, I was just getting a little closer to take another look. Damn it. Poor Rakuna. I know, right? Bad shit is happening to me. Uh, anyways, guys, I'm going to go uh, on a little break. I'll be back in two minutes. I'm going to stretch and all that. Ugh. I'll be right back. All right, so, uh, yeah, we're back at it. Uh, so I believe we got to go back this way and uh, see if we can find the pieces that we need. Probably there'll be a... something that opened. Of course. Conveniently. Thank you for opening the doors for me, guys. Really appreciate it. Don't, don't follow me, though. Don't. 
dear. It's too dark in there. I can't see shit. I think I can go this way. Oh, God. I Do I really want to? I guess I have to. There might be a giant shark down here. I don't know. Oh. Yeah, that, there's a handle missing. So we got a series of things we got to fix all over this goddamn ship. Oh, God. Hi. Hey. Awfully close there, buddy. Uh, we've made it down into the cargo area. We were told to stay in the superstructure, but no one goes up there anymore with what's happened to the medical deck. It should be safe down here, but uh, to make sure nothing can follow us, we've removed the drive chain from the elevator. Of course he did. Of freaking course he did. You got a light bulb. <laughs> got a light bulb. That's uh, my source of light. Ha, idiot. Don't get too close. Oh, shit, you freaking bastard. Uh, dick. Asshole. Where'd you go? <laughs> Want to kick your ass. Okay, we can't go in there. So I got a light bulb. <laughs> Just realized you were playing this. Hey, Frecky. <laughs> been having fun. It's not been stressful at all. It's been a it's been a breeze. Oh, I see you. Don't don't do that. Don't do that. You already bashed my head in the freaking floor many times. Oh, look at that. Let there be light, I say. And there's nothing over here. Yes, for that. <laughs> How's it going? It's going well. <laughs> it's going well. Yeah, it is, it, it's good. A lot of spooky moments. Oh, God damn it. Hi. Hey. Oh, that asshole is walk. That asshole walked. Okay, more and more crew members are finding themselves on a medical deck. More patients are experience cha uh, experiencing chest pains and worsening symptoms. Uh, could this be contagious? The crew are growing increasingly anxious. The best thing we can do is uh, keep them quarantined on a medical deck. Uh, between this fog, the engines going down, being missed by that rescue team, and now the sickness, it's becoming difficult to keep everyone calm. Well, you better try Harder. All right. There's nothing in here. You got nothing, right? You, you have nothing? Keep your distance. Keep away from me, dick. I, I don't trust you. Freaking second here. I'm not moving. I'm not breathing. Okay. All good. There's a valve in the head. Oh, God. Why? Why? Why is that there? Ah, oh, jeez. Uh, hey. I see you there, buddy. I see you. You just stare, staring at me. Playing with me. Probably the one fucking with the lights. And that guy's God. Of course. Of course it is. <laughs> Damn, I missed it. <laughs> he was playing with his cog earlier. <laughs> yes, I was. It was a glorious moment. Okay, where... where? Where did I need to use that again? Is it back over that way? I think it is, right? Over there was only the light. Yeah, I know you guys are there. I know you're there. 
I think it's over that way. That's where I gotta use the valve, open the door, open something. Oh no, maybe I'm wrong. Ah, darn it. Let me just double check. Over there we need the cog. Over there we need the light. And over here... Uh... Yeah, it's not, it's not what we needed. I think we had to go back in the area with the water. Let's just go there. <laughs> Use 50 bits to play a scare? Why did you spend bits on the scare I already have in my blurbs? <laughs> I mean, thank you. I, I, I appreciate it, but I already had that sound in my blurbs. Oh. I see somebody there. I I kind of see somebody there. Yeah, it's very hard to see since I don't have a freaking flashlight. Oh yeah, of course. Oh yeah, you just overdid it now, did ya? Don't worry about a thing. Cause every little thing is gonna be alright. I better not do that, otherwise I'm gonna copyright. <laughs> ah, yeah, freaking. Really? Baby noises? How dare you? <laughs> that is the worst thing you could play at this time. <laughs> uh. Hey, I got a flashlight. I can see shit again. Okay, there was nothing left over here. There's this asshole over there. Well, he ain't whistling back. And he's not walking towards me. That's cool. As you get out of the water for a couple of seconds, you have the, uh... What was that? You still have the wet noise from your feet. <laughs> Dare you bring up baby noises while I'm playing this. It's not tense enough as it is. Then I can go over here right, got a way here that's a good sign oh hi look like you're deep in thoughts there I won't bother you anymore it appears that those who first started showing symptoms has spent more time on the main deck. Could it be exposure to the fog that's causing this strange sickness? So far, none of the crew who have been confined to the lower decks have gotten sick. I've been outside a few times, but thankfully my duty keeps me mostly indoors. As a precaution, the captain has ordered uh, that the crew are not to go above deck for any reason until further notice. Yep. <laughs> you got it for me, Frecky. <laughs> Damn it, Frecky, you generous bastard. <laughs> you are so kind. Okay, so we got a stairway going up over here. Let's go further. Yeah, Frecky, Frecky is uh, the man. Don't whistle. Don't whistle. Don't you dear frickin' whistle. Okay, I'm hearing a lot of knocking sounds and... Okay, you didn't walk. That's good. Okay, so there was a stairway going up here, and I think... Yeah, that's the other path that I saw. 
Okay. Okay. My God. Okay. Oh my God. Uh, I gotta do this until I get the right order. Easy peasy, lemon squeezy. Stay there. Now what did that do? Which room did that mess around with? I guess that generator room. <laughs> well, obviously I can go there now. Can I open this now? Uh, probably don't want to go and try and jump that, right? Hey guys. How you doing? Doing good? I'm just gonna go over that way. You guys stay put. I'll get help. Apparently... What? There's nothing I can do here? Oh, shit. Yeah, don't look down, right? Don't look down. Okay, all good. Obviously, there had to be that. There's a lot of uh, gore, blood and gore over here. Oh, you're freaking walking, aren't you? I heard you. I heard you walk, asshole. And the, the only thing you're going to do if you catch up to me is you're going to smash my head on the floor and then run away like a freaking coward. So stop wasting your time. Um, you stay there. I can't open this. What do I got to do here? Dude, where? Where'd he go? Where is he? Oh, wait. Okay, don't wonder about the other guy I was following before. Guess that was a helmet cam or something? It looks big. They left you to die. God. Ugh.
Well, that door is now open. I'll go through the door. And that is the beauty of life, guys. That's how spider babies are born, or whatever the freaking hell that was. Ugh. Right. Over the last few days, the patients have been getting worse. We, uh, what started as chest pain soon developed in a strange hardening of the skin and stifling of joints until the patient is unable to move on their own. The illness has already proven fatal in some cases. Stranger still, some of the bodies have gone missing from the morgue. We need to get the remaining patients to the hospital as soon as possible. I guess that never happened, now didn't it? Oh, that's, that's the room that that dude was at. I think so. Must be going mad. I've been seeing some of my friends again, but that's impossible. They're dead. I know they're dead. I saw it happen. But every now and then, I see them again, watching me from across the room. Something, it, sometimes it feels like they're guiding me. Oh, medical, uh, yeah, medic. <laughs> the fudge was that? Okay, that door's locked. You know, I haven't saved in a while. Hi, hey, what's up? I heard you. I heard you freaking walking. Oh, yeah. Of course. Yeah, uh, yeah, of course you had to respond. Uh, what was that? Oh, the lever, the, the, yes, the pressure, va oh, God, you're moving closer. I'm hearing skittering as well. Oh, God, I hate this. I wish I had some flares. When's the last time I saved? All right. Run. 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 Okay. Fine. I wasn't nervous. Oh, shit! Uh, run! Run! Don't look at me! Go up! Come on, do it! Get out of there! Go faster! Ugh. Everything's fine. Everything's okay. We're we're all having a good time. Everything is peachy. And I just want to save. Yeah, there it is. Booyah, bitches! I feel like that was a long time between saves. I don't like it. All right, uh, yes. Okay, so we got to go in the green. Okay, let's go check out the other one, see what that does. It's hard to see which one are... Okay. Nope, that, that's, that's, that's not it. Ah, just a smidgen more. I think this one. Booyah! Okay, that means that door is going to be open now, I think. Uh, yeah. Let's do it again, because I'm just paranoid. I just solved a very difficult puzzle. Of course, it's going to be safe down there. <laughs> it's very dark in here. I'd feel safer with my flares.
<laughs> oh, God. All beautiful. You guys are awesome. Okay, so we got the chain storage key. Chain storage key. Where? Where? Where is that? The helicopter is fixed up and we're almost back to the ship. What's going on in there? I'm ordering pizza. Now, I'm heading up to the superstructure now uh, to release the lockdown. I've searched the lower decks and found no survivors. Really? Really? That's all you're going to tell him? Understood. We'll be there to extract you soon. We've just got a visual on the ship. Looks like it's coming up on a large uh, fog bank. Yeah, shit, that's not good. Do not enter the fog. I'll explain later. Well, you had better hurry then. We don't have much time before the fog reaches you. Well, no dilly dallying anymore. We we gotta get this working. Okay, so we got the the key for the uh, chain whatever locker thing storage locked storage. Uh, where where, where was that? I mean, we did come across a couple of locked doors. Oh, there you go. That was it. Huh. Yes. The elevator drive chain. Is there anything else in here? You know, I could have just used some brute force on the goddamn door, right? I would have saved a whole lot of trouble, <laughs> to be honest. down there let's go up that was just for the mood thank you okay hey it's a uh, it's freaking fixed and we got a light back we're in business ladies and gentlemen we're gonna get off of this ship or probably uh, be part of the crew part of the uh, the monsters eventually okay uh, elevator Elevator. I hate this. We're in deck seven. Five. Shit. Come on, this is it. Go up. Oh, hi. Hey, what's up? Are you? Do you, you want to come in? Who is that dude? I don't know. I feel like he's part of the big mystery. Find a way onto the bridge. Oh, it looks like we got a couple of floors here. Okay, nav deck. Cool. Right. Yeah, let's just go through the door, right? A level three security clearance is required to access the bridge. If you think you should have access but haven't uh, been issued a key card, see the security officer on A deck. Well, let's go on a deck, right? We're on uh, we're on B, right? I guess we don't have a choice but to go down. Well, this is a deck. That's locked. That's open. Oh, hey, hey, how you doing? I'm gonna go and borrow your bathroom there, if you don't mind. Of course I don't have a reflection. Of course. Hope you don't mind if I, uh, snoop around? Oh shit, they have hiding spots. <laughs> Y'all know what that means, right? That probably means we're gonna be, uh, encountering the big dude again. 
just not going to be good. Okay. What the hell? What is that? Right, so you can check through the cameras. We got a laundromat over here. Great. Oh, four, two, three, nine. All right, let's uh, let's remember that. Oh, hey, there was somebody there, and it's not there anymore. Behind me? No. <laughs> okay. Uh, waiting to write credential. Please insert blank key card. Security clearance disk. So it seems that we need more stuff. Okay, until further notice, the security disk for creating new key cards will remain with me. Over the last few days, we've seen a number of crew members trying to gain unauthorized access to the bridge to release the lockdown, and that's a risk I'm not willing to take. Things will go back to normal once we've uh, once we're out of this fog, and it's safe to lift the lockdown. Captain Taylor. Sure, Captain Taylor. So we gotta find Captain Taylor. Is that where the camera was? Yeah. Oh shit! What? No, wait, why? Why? Are you telling me I shouldn't be snooping around this shit? Oh god. God, 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 god. Open the goddamn door. Lock her. <laughs> Playing with a <the> deck. <laughs> uh Boom, there it is. Oh, he's coming. How many times can he smash me on the ground before I die, right? All right, can you please get out of here? I got shit to do, man. I got shit to do. We're heading towards the fog, and we need to clear this area before it hits us. You know, I, I want to see my family. I want to see Timmy again. Uh, select an item. What? I don't think that has anything to do with this. No. I'm not I'm not walking on that side. Of, <laughs> I don't trust you. Okay, so eventually I will find an item. I'm going to have to uh mess around with it. Of course everything's goddamn locked. Okay, one. There's no obvious. Uh, there's no obvious sequence or anything. Oh, look at that! A save. I don't mind if I do. I will save. So, yeah. Until we actually find a clue, I don't think there's a point to this. So the password was four two five nine, right? Four two five nine. I just want to double check. No, uh, it's not that one. Four, two, three, nine. There are you? Okay, that door's locked. We got a hiding spot over here. If uh, Dumbo decides to come over and cause all sorts of problems. Look at me, sure. Look at me, sure. <laughs> I'm the captain now. <laughs> ok 
Okay, there's the elevator. And this is to go outside. And since conditions are red, we're not going outside. I think we better go downstairs. Oh, keep out. That means go in, right? It won't open. <laughs> of course it won't. All right, that's the door to go outside as well. Sea deck. Okay, Scott, Miranda, Nick, Stafford, Edward, Briggs. Five, Krista. Six, Fred. I wonder if there's something with these names. Obviously, if they're showing us these names, there's obviously something to do with this. We got a cramped up storage area over here. It's absolutely nothing. Right. Got a hiding spot. And uh, no clues. Maybe in the bathroom. Yep. Absolutely nothing. Hey, wait a second. Wait a second. Where the hell is a toilet paper? What? Okay. You know what? I'm asking too many questions here. Uh, okay, we got toilets here. Oh, God. What the hell are you doing there, buddy? Don't whistle back. Okay, whatever whistle was in another room out there. Okay, we got a whole lot of nada in here as well. No, don't close it me inside of the bathroom. Another hiding spot. Absolutely freaking nothing. Let's keep looking. Is that somebody bashing on a wall or... Is it the big guy coming down the stairs? Okay, to all new recruits, welcome aboard! Your personal belongings can be stored in your designated locker in a storage room across the hall, the combination of which has been set to your birth year. Feel free to change the combination. Any bulkier items have been stowed in the cargo hold. Sweet. Ah, okay. Okay, so the names, probably there's going to be, uh, yeah, there's going to be a, a list somewhere with the birth dates of all the names that we've encountered associated to the numbers. Going to have to find and locate this shit. Hi. Seems like you're trapped there. Right, we got the shower over, yeah. There's uh, like uh, okay, looks like there's something in a drain. It can't be reached by hand. Well, okay, I'm gonna have to figure that shit out later. Cause right now I don't have anything with me that's gonna help me with that task. Okie dokie. So what do we have here? Okay, G. Hackett. Okay. Apparently we're going to need that for something. Oh, that's a laundry room. That's what's making that racket. <laughs> DGS flashback. Right, so we got a computer here. All 
right, so I need to figure out what the birthday is on these uh, for these guys. Maybe this room will hold clues. I knew it. I knew it, you freaking bastard. Don't you, don't you move. Oh, hey. Uh, of course the hand would move by itself. Oh, sweet. Well, that is added to the archive, so I can go back to uh, a deck, I think. I think... Th oh, shit! Okay. <laughs> Why did that scare me <laughs> more than other things? It was just a normal dude running straight at me. God darn it. Ah, okay. All right. Okay, uh, let's do a quick save here, and let's look at the, uh, wh where do I see my, my notebook? Uh, notes, right? Okay, main access, blah, 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 the incident, engine failures, Dr. Hayes, passenger sickness, uh, miscellaneous. Ah, okay. Can I pin this? Okay, so the only one we need to open is four, one, three, and five. Okay, let's try this. Oh, huzzah! All right, so, uh, yeah. So we got another notebook. Now we got the dates. So let's head back downstairs. I wonder what that big guy has gotten to, right? So, okay, uh, yeah, somebody remember these names. Scott, Miranda, Nick, Edward, Krista, and Fred. Yeah, right, okay. <laughs> <laughs> they don't have toilet paper, but you use I use them all the time. I have, don't worry if there was a function where I could sit and flush, I would have done it. So, Scott, Miranda, Nick, Edward, Krista, and Fred. Oh, my Oh, my Oh, my Jesus Christ. <laughs> okay. Uh, Scott, okay, Scott, Miranda, okay, 1976. Yeah, wait, what the fuck, I didn't need that. I didn't need that at all. Scott, Miranda, and Nick, okay, so number three. Uh, can I please just go back down there? Thank you. 1984. Uh, 1984. Oh, string with hook. Of, of course you'd have that in your locker. But it was only one that I needed. All this, uh, all this stuff just for that little one. Right, let's head back to the shower. That's not it. Oh, I went the wrong way. Should be over here. You're still there. I could have fit my hand through there. I could have. Okay. 
Officer's key. Maybe it's one of the doors that was locked, right? Where's that big guy? Eventually, he's gonna show up again. Oh, hi! Hey, what's up? He's not there anymore. I feel like he's trying to tell me something. Alright, have a good night, spirit. Thank you for stopping by. <laughs> Enjoy your stream. What are you streaming to tonight, by the way? That's not it. That's locked. Aha! Let me use your bathroom. Yep, there's nothing to use in here. Okay, this is the blank key card. Now we just need the uh, the the key code thing, Shigamabob. Oh God, I have no clue. It's the really hard one in the prison. I mean, the okay. Oh, Phasma Weekly Challenge, the hard one in the prison. Oh my God. Holy crap. <laughs> In a prison, it's uh, really difficult. Hey, hi. So I got the nameplate. You think the nameplate I can use on that thing? Uh, I doubt there's anything that I can do that with that. It doesn't make any sense. Maybe the blank key card? I can see something through it? Right? No? Okay. Eventually I'll find something that works. Zero sanity. <laughs> hey, Patrick Irwing. Thank you. Hello, welcome. Uh, welcome to the stream. I was wanting uh, you to play Fricky, but it's uh, definitely a plus to have you there for this one. All right, this is this is hard. This is uh I don't have any extra key. Maybe Let me do a quick save over here. All right, let me just put the key in there. All right? So I got one of the things. Now, what do I do to get the other one? So I got the name the nameplate. But I don't know what the freaking hell that does. There seemed to be another lower floor that we could go to. Yeah, we can't go up higher because that's where we need the key. And over here we just can't go in there just won't open maybe it'll open on its own after we accomplish something uh, is there anything down here hi yep oh you freaking bastard are you gonna let me open the door or are you gonna be a dick about it Screw you. That's locked. Ah, oh, come on, really? Uh, you're all terrible people. Okay, we got a key over here. I'm gonna be, uh, Dramatically taken. The communications room key. 
Okay, good. We're making progress. There's a guitar there. Oh, shit! Of course! Of course you had to be there! God darn it! Uh... Oh god damn it! No! No 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 no! Nope, 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 nope. Is there a locker? No, there's not a locker. Is there a locker here? Okay, I'm fine. Everything's okay. Oh shit. No, nothing's okay. Oh, look at that. That bastard is down here. Gotta go kind of mess around, go around him. Yep, he's there. He's there. Okay, so I got a communication room key. Where's the communication? Oh, shit! Hi! Hey, big guy! Wow, you were going to the ex- Oh, no, not there. Not there. No, not here. Here. Maybe. Yeah, here. Well, I wasn't expecting that. <laughs> Uh, 4239, is that the save con combo? No, I already uh, figured out the one out. I knew exactly what it was. That was for uh, that was for another thing, right? Or did we not figure that one out? I always think if they give you a save point, why? <laughs> Let's go back the wrong way. Yeah, 4239. Did I use that? I don't think I used that. I'm not sure. I can't recall for some reason. <laughs> I have no memory of using that. Well, maybe uh, this will have opened up something interesting. Hi, guys. Working out or hardly working out? No? That's not working, right? Okay, so we got some weights here, and uh, this castle's moving. I don't know why he bust the door open when there was a door right there. Made a hole through the goddamn wall for no reason. I think I read this, there. Eh? Being the chief mate, Norton, si uh... Sits at the head of the table. Blackwood and Anchorman like a glass of wine with their meals. Layton sits opposite, opposite of Blackwood. Hackett sits at the uh, the end of the table, closest to the gallery. Ah, great. Okay. Oh, that's the nameplate. Shit. Okay, let's let's read that note again. <laughs> uh, being the chief mate, Norton sits at the head of the table. So it's going to be Norton there. Blackwood and Ackerman like a glass of wine with their meals. Layton sits opposite to Blackwood. Hackett sits at the uh, end of the table closest to the galley. So over here... Uh, Oh, God damn it! I can I can I use the other one, the uh, the one that I picked up as well. So okay, Norton sits at the hell head of the table. Where's Norton? Do we not have all the names yet? 
Oh, uh, we don't? I think we're missing a few names here. Okay, so we need to find a couple more names. I think that so far we only have uh, one, two, and three. You no, know, we have two names. We got to find them all. All right, maybe now that the uh, big guy's gone away, we can focus a little bit more on what we have to do here. These guys aren't moving or posing any threats. I think I can move closer to them without having to worry about anything. I'm starting to think that maybe their name tags are all going to be upstairs in their respective rooms. Okay. Well, I guess that's what we're gonna have to do. Look at this. He made a mess. Please come and pick up your crap, man. I'm not getting closer to you, sir. Nope. Is there anything in the back here? No? Another hidden item. Alright, gotta investigate these rooms real quick. I think it would be obvious if there was a, a name tag in there. I mean, the one that I found, it was quite obvious. I don't know how I did not see the other ones if they were supposed to be uh, apparent. Could they be in the bathroom? Right? Yeah? I don't know why they put their name tags in the bathroom to begin with. This toilet seat belongs to me. Got more notes here. What are the items that I have? Yeah. So I do have the communication room key. Okay, maybe that is another thing that I could... Uh, that I could do. Is there like maybe a name tag in one of these? No. I just gotta go find out where the communication room key is. Can I go in here? No. Yeah. I think this might be the one where I already found one of the, uh, yeah, that's where I found the, the one that I, that I picked up earlier. Yeah. So these things aren't just lying around. Yeah, I heard you take a freaking step, asshole. Stay put. Yep, I gotta mess around with him. I wonder, can we go back in the elevator? That is one question. It, yeah, I think we can. Yeah, it's coming down. Okay, where is the communications? It's on A deck. Let's go on A-Deck. Let's go and uh, find the communication room. Since we obviously uh, haven't used the key for that yet. Oh, there it is. Okay, what was the password again? 4239? Let's go try that out. Oh, there you go. Rest. What? 
Uh, rest. Does that ring the bell to anyone? <laughs> I doubt it. Oh, Crest, okay. Oh my god. No, no, no. Re reset. R. Right, okay. Okay, Crest, C-R. Okay, R-E. S. And T. Oh, that wasn't too hard. Library key. Shit, where's the library now? God darn it. Uh, we are still next to the elevator. Oh, God. Yeah, it's right there. Okay, where's the library? Library, library, library. Down on D deck. All right, let's. I mean, we are in the elevator. Might as well do it. <clears throat> Where's the elevator music? I'm scared I'm going to open the door. It's going to open the door one time and big guy will be there. Oh, I remember you. What are you holding? I shall take that, please, if you don't mind. Why don't you hit it in the goddamn head before? What What did you get? What is that? Oh, shit, you piece of crap. Of course you had to. You bastard. That make you feel more powerful? Is that it? Dick. Okay, Blackwood. He was one of them that wanted a glass of wine. So, wooden statue. Okay, let's go back upstairs. That's where we had to use it for the... Uh, yeah, we had to use it on the light. That's not it. That's not you guys. Not creepy at all. What the hell was that all about? Right. Um, gonna save here. Let's go to the end here. Still can't go inside the captain's room. Were you... Were, was it two of you there before? Was that always the case? <clears throat> oh, okay. So, let's just uh, swing this thing around and figure out what the hell it means. Are you guys seeing a pattern or anything so far? No? Obviously, this is what we gotta do with it. I'm just not sure how it goes. My god, what are you supposed to do with this? Match the shadows to the guy. Yeah, uh... Trying. <laughs> I'm trying. Oh, wait a second. Wait a second. Uh, it's kind of hard because you can only use the mouse to do this. Oh. Got it. I'll pick both of these things out. 
Oh, we got a locker combination. 12, 7, 2, and 5. Sweet. And I'll take this nameplate. We're still missing a nameplate after this, I believe. Alright, you guys, uh... That guy moved. That asshole moved. Okay, can I... Can I get... I can't have that, uh, note... No. Okay, 12, 7, 2, 5. Boom. That wasn't too hard. Didn't need to go all around and all that. Yeah, we got the last one. Dr. Norton, which I believe was the one at the head of the table, if I'm not mistaken. Hmm. We're doing pretty darn good. Very Resident Evil type of puzzles, so, but doing good nonetheless. All right, let's find that room. Shit. Okay, that was me. That was me freaking out for no reason. All right, so, uh... Let's look at that note again. So, table, okay. Norton at the head of the table, black wooden uh, Ackerman like a glass of wine. Layton sits at the opposite of uh, Blackwood. And Hackett sits at the end of the table closest to the galley. Uh, I gotta take the other ones off. Okay, Norton's gonna be over here. That's going to be Blackwood. Layton in front here. Ackerman. And Hackett, right? No? Maybe I got to switch. Hey, old Frecky. Uh, <laughs> thank you for stopping. Uh, stopping by. Uh, I'll check out the stream and replay. All right. That's cool. Enjoy. Have fun. So I think, uh, let me just double check that note. Why do I have to scroll down all the way again? I could sit at the end of the table closest to galley. Uh, so I must have switched those around. Okay. Yeah, let's go and replace that one here. Uh, uh, it's still going to be. Oh, wait a second. That's going to be Blackwood over here. Let's remove that. And... Be Layton and and there you go. Well, it's not too hard. Seen worse. Okay, the captain's key. Ooh. There's the big guy. Well, he's not around. Okay, I'm not complaining. You don't move. So the captain's cabin is on deck A. Let's do this. Hmm. <laughs> oh yeah. Hello? Yeah, we gotta go further almost up to the end there. 
There are still some doors, like this bathroom door, it's still locked. Maybe we'll find the key for that in the captain's quarters. Oof. Nope. I think the captain's having a seizure or something. Hey, can I help you, guy? Uh, what? Can, I wish you'd stop that. Uh, let me grab this thing. Uh, Alright. I hope you... Uh, what? Okay, well, he just vanished on me. I didn't even get to finish my... Sentence. That's just fine. Archives. Oh, we don't even have the option to. Oh, no, God damn it. What the freaking hell? Oh. Oh, no. Oh god, no. Of course. I was so close. Couldn't have just been like, oh, you almost, you know, you're going to win. Nope, nope, no, nope, no, nope. you're screwed. That's okay. You're dragging out the game. All right, what is this? The key, uh, the padlock key. Oh, that must be how I get, oh, freaking, no. God, no. You can't reach me. You can't reach me. I'm super crouched. There's no way you're gonna touch me that way with your creepy arms. Ah. Yeah, okay. You keep looking at that wall. Oh, don't. No, no. God darn it. Sir, so, I'll leave you alone, sir. It was nice talking to you, by the way. I don't like that the lights are flickering. Patients appear to be suffering from an unknown illness. The illness progresses as follows. The patient experiences intense chest pain, which will worsen over time. Fatigue's be to set in, and the color will uh, uh, the color of the patient's skin begin uh, begin to take a paler tone. The patient will begin to show signs of impaired mobility due to stiffening of the joints. X-ray shows signs of calcific calcification of internal organs, beginning from the lungs and then spreading out throughout the rest of the body. This makes breathing difficult for the patients. Calcification begins to affect the skin as well as giving the patient a, a stone-like appearance. The virulence of the illness seems to be related to the length of exposure to the fog, with the quickest death occurring within two days, while others have survived for up to two weeks. The cause of death is most cases is uh, in most cases is respiratory failure caused by excessive calcification of the lungs. However, the process seems to continue even after death until the entire body has been calcified and becomes this special bundle of joy, right? Huh? He's a good guy. Well, the, glad to know that the fog is reason for this. <laughs> okay. I haven't checked the other rooms. Uh, yeah, Mr. Mr. Smith, it's now your turn. You, you can stop waiting. Come on. Let's get up. Giddy up. No? Yeah. Uh, okay, I'll leave you to it. The lights are failing. On my flashlight, it's flickering. I don't like that at all. It's locked. What do you mean it's locked? I just found a freaking padlock key. God darn it. I just wanted a hug. 
Do the mannequins uh, just murder you or do they touch you? Oh, they touch me all right. They freaking touch me all over. Okay, stay seated, sir. I just have to see if there's other keys. Ah. I miss a uh, I miss a key somewhere. Yeah. Everything in this room seems to have been acquired. Do you do you have a key, sir? No. Yeah. Were you one of the moving types? No, uh, that that other one over there was a moving type. The asshole that I just closed the door in his goddamn face. I didn't go down there. Alright, you guys ready for your surgery? Yeah? You stay seated, sir. Please. Hey. <laughs> Oh shit! Oh god damn it! There was that another hand in the back there. Did I get the key at least? Where's the dude? Ah, uh, he just went up and disappeared. I don't think this is how surgery is supposed to go usually. I think you're supposed to try and save the patient, not decapitate them. Okay, that guy's still seated. It's all good. We got two more doors. Hello? Yeah, I'm sure you did that. I blame you. I accuse you of doing the things that you did. Oh my god, you piece of crap, you dickhead. Ah. You know, it's basically mostly all the same jump, stay, <laughs> jump scare throughout the game. But it still gets you. All right, this room seems to have absolutely nothing in it. So I did find another padlock key. And maybe that's all it took. Let's go and check it out. Yes! Ha! We're free from this nightmare. Well, I mean, not free from that. I'm free from that nightmare on that floor. There's plenty more nightmares to come, I'm sure. Right now we can't go through there, but we can go through here. Yes, and we have the credentials. Uh, Scott, Ick, Ick, okay, we, yeah, one of the... Uh, one of the dudes. Okay, time to go upstairs. Unless the floor breaks under me again. The ship will be entering the fog any minute now. Where the hell are you? I'm taking my sweet ass time. Wasn't that door close? Oh, no, okay, that's right. Oh, look at that. Level the... Ah, yeah, yeah, yeah. We read all of that. Hells yes! Uh, release the lockdown. It's gonna be a boss fight, I'm sure. Where's the lockdown? It's not it. Oh, right over here, right? <laughs> Sweet. Okay. Lockdown is out. Oh, wow. A way out. Great. Let's uh, get the hell out of here. Oh, 
Okay. Flashlight's out. Don't need the flashlight anymore. Nah, I'm good. I'm getting out of this ship. Hells yes. Alright, where's the chopper? Get to the chopper. Oh my god, there it is. There it is. Uh, I guess I gotta go maybe to the second floor. Oh, crap. Come on, don't leave without me. I'm here. Yes. Sweet. Now, blow it out of orbit. It's the only way to make sure. Okay, no, uh, it's gotta be something else. It's not gonna be happy endings from here. Oh, the ship is entering the fog. <laughs> well done, thank you. Return, complete the game. Wow. And that was uh that was it? Wait a second, wait a second, wait a second. Are they just gonna return me to the main menu and that's it? No, like uh like three days later the guy looks at his arm and he's he has stiff joints or <laughs> like he's slowly turning into one of them because he got a little bit of fog in his lungs or got infected. No, no, none of that. Wow. But anyways, hey, that was that was amazing. Yeah, usually I would have ended it at that like 20 minutes ago, but I knew I w was probably going to be able to finish the game in, the, in one go. So, uh, yeah, that was it. That was Lazarus. And uh, it is currently on sale now, if I'm not mistaken, on Steam. If you want, you can go ahead and uh, give it a go yourself. It's a pretty decent game, except that jump scares get a little repetitive. But I think there should be a more challenging option where the big guy roams the uh, corridors a little bit more often. And you really have to uh, kind of sneak your way past and maybe some of the, um, you know, you have a little bit of life so you can take some damage and not, like, basically being hit by the mannequins. You don't have any real consequences, that gets, except you get a little jump scare and that's it. But, but still, very enjoyable game. I did, I did have a good time. I uh, got scared a few times. You might have noticed, but uh, yeah, that was it. Anyways, guys, thank you very much for joining. I hope you enjoyed. If you did, don't forget to nudge that little like button on uh, YouTube. If you're on Twitch, uh, please follow. If you're not following already, it helps out the channel, helps out the uh, algorithm. Anyways, thank you, and until next time, take care and stay safe. Rick, you out.